subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you'll be one of the first persons to know whenever we drop a new video now let's take you straight up to the main news unilag undergraduate student snuffs life out of sugar daddy The Lagos State Police Command has paraded a 21-year-old female undergraduate of the University of Lagos in connection with the death of the Chief Executive Officer of Super TV, Michael Osifo Ataga. The lady who was identified as Chidima Adora Ojuku was earlier paraded for allegedly snuffing the life out of Michael Osifo Ataga in conspiration with some other persons who are currently at large. In a statement that was released by the spokesperson of the Lagos State Police Command, CSP, Olimu Iwa Adejobi, it disclosed that a case of murder was transferred from the Morocco Division of the Command to the State Criminal Investigation Department, Panti Yaba, for discrete investigation. The fact of the case is that on the 15th of June 2021, at about 1700 hours, one Chidima Adora Ojuku, a 300 level undergraduate student of the University of Lagos, conspired with others who are still at large to allegedly murder Michael Usifu Ataga, male, aged 50, by stabbing him severely with a sharp object at a short service apartment situated at number 19. Adewale Oshin Street, Lekki Phase 1, Lagos. The statement further said that the prime suspect Chidima Adora Ojuku, who had earlier booked for the apartment on the 13th of June 2021, secretly left the apartment after the deed had been done on the 15th of June at about 17.30 hours. The suspect was later tracked and arrested in a residence at number 57 Akiwumi Street, Alajo Meji, Yaba, Lagos. During the search, the prime suspect and mass communication student of the University of Lagos was caught with a blood soaked cloth obstinately worn on the day of the incident. The suspect confessed to have stabbed the deceased with a kitchen knife after a struggle. She further confessed to have taken the knife away while leaving the scene and disposed same in a dustbin at a residence. It was also revealed that Chidima Adora Ojuku, after the incident occurred, stole the deceased iPhone and also withdrew the sum of 380,000 naira from the deceased account using the deceased ATM card. Police have said that the case will be charged to court as soon as investigations is concluded. Well, why investigation is ongoing to also arrest other accomplices in the case. Michael Usifu Ataga is a chief executive officer of Super Network Limited since April 2014 before he met his Waterloo. The Super TV, also called Super, Netw Super Network, is a media streaming entertainment company situated in Lagos State. Michael Usifu Ataga was married with children and reportedly based in Abuja. He was said to have lost his life a few days to his 50th birthday. Reports have it that his mother even celebrated him on his birthday unknowingly to her that he has crossed over. During a confessional interview, Chidima said that she had met the disease four months back through a friend who connected them and has said that on this occasion, Usifo Ataga had invited her to the apartment in Lekki. It was also revealed that she was the one who got the apartment for them, probably 
to make it more discreet and safe considering the image of the Lagos multi-millionaire Mike Usifo. She also said that they met a few months ago and when uh, Usifo had invited her to Lagos to spend some time that they both were involved in drugs which got them very high and Usifo decided to have his way with her which he did and that made her very angry. She said she did what she did under the influence of drugs. Watch this short clip. Okay, so why, why did you like, what was it about the first time that you did like, what did you do or uh, what happened? I was, I was, I was trying to, I was sleep, I was trying to sleep, it was midnight, so we were drunk and we had um, smoked, so I was already like sleeping, and then, Continue. and then I was already sleeping. Was there weed in the room? So how long, how long did you guys stay? Did you check in on Sunday? When did you die? Which day did you die? And when did you leave him? And how were you able to escape from the room after killing him or just walking in? Well, why why was lying there? I just I changed and then I left the room. I looked for the key for where he ate it and I left it away. So when you escaped, who did you reach out to? Where was the first place you went to? So how do you feel when you know that you have killed somebody and you just sneaked out? How do you feel at 21 committing this kind of crime? Well, I'm not sure. What did you do with the ATM letter? Which is ATM? I reduced the money. How much? And um, Eighty thousand. Eighty thousand. Not five million. 
On confirmed reports, have you that in your original account you have about 10 million naira? How did you get such amount of money? So how was it traced to you? The police also arrested the father of Chidima for trying to resist the arrest of his daughter when the officers of the the Nigerian Police Force Lagos Command had come to pick her up at their resident number 57, Akiwumi Street, Yaba. The father of the prime suspect said he did not believe that his daughter committed any offense because she actually told them that she was going for an altering event in Lekki Phase 1. He resisted the arrest until he heard the confessional statement by his daughter and he was very, very devastated. Friends and lecturers of Chidima Adora Ojuku at the University of Lagos had said that she is a part-time student of mass communication, an introvert, very quiet and keeps to herself. Lecturers also confirm that Chidima is a cool-headed girl who attends her lectures, takes her notes seriously and leaves immediately the class is over. Other of her classmates said that they usually receive lectures as part-time students from 5 p.m. To about 8 p.m. on weekends and they said that Chidima does not interact with people as she doesn't talk so much in class but that one thing you could identify her with was a striking beauty and adding that to the fact that she looks very innocent and doesn't talk in class made it a root shock to many as it was revealed that she was a prime suspect in the case of the mother of Super TV CEO Michael Usifo Ataga. Since the report of the incident, many have asked, where is the wife of Michael Usifo Ataga? Well, she is stealing money over the root shock of the news of the death of her husband. It was revealed that she is a very big oil magnate in Nigeria, as well as very intelligent and powerful. Well, the issue here is that many people feel that Chidima, according to her confessional statement, did what she did in self-defense. And some have said, that it depends on how the case goes because in the case in cases like this it, she could either get a 45 year prison sentence or a death by hanging sentence many people have called that young ladies who are in the habit of going after rich powerful married men in the name of sugar daddies to disease from such art as it could end in their downfall as well as advising men who are married to stay faithful to their partners to ensure that they live long. So there you have it guys, Chidima Adora Ojuku has confessed to a crime in the murder case of Mike Usifu Ataga, a Lagos multi-millionaire who also has been a sugar daddy for the past four months. What do you think about this case? What could likely happen to Chidima? Drop your comment in the comment section as we will be reading them. Welcome back. Thank you so much for staying with us till the end of this video. But before we go, we just want to let you know that we're also on Facebook and on Instagram at DJMTV. Also check out our website at www.djmtv.news. There we drop news 247 non-stop. Do not forget that you could also place your advert with us here on DJMTV News and be rest assured that your business will get to the desired market. Well, so we'll come your way again with another edition of DJN TV Daily News Update. I remain your host, Lauro Fable. Yeah. DJN TV.